which single exercise has the potential to assist the ACL with stabilizing the knee joint during high risk tasks? Find out in this new study by Kai et al, 2025. The hamstrings and gluteal muscles have the potential to assist the ACL with stabilizing the knee joint. The single leg RDL is one of the most effective exercises to generate both high hamstring and gluteal muscle forces. So in this study, Kai et al took 14 recreationally active participants through a supervised eight week, 16 sessions of progressive intensity single leg RDL training. They only trained one leg, and they used the other leg as a control. They performed maximal isometric testing on all the major lower limb muscles and biomechanics testing. They used 3D motion capture during their double leg counter movement jump, single leg lateral hops, triple vertical jumps, and 45 to 60 degree side step cutting. So what were the results? The trained limb had really good improvements in the 3RM single leg RDL, and there's no surprises there. When they compared it to the control limb, there was actually reduced knee valgus movement and knee extension moments during their triple vertical jumps. Now the limitations were that there was no change in the sidestep cutting or their bilateral jump landings. So what are the takeaways? It's not the be all and the end all, and it doesn't change your sidestep cutting. But eight weeks at two times a week of single leg RDLs might reduce your external knee joint loading during your dynamic single leg tasks that might reduce your ACL injury risk.